Uh, Yvette Brown asks, uh, I hear tell of bobbleheads. This is for community. Is there community merchandise now? There is bobbleheads. Uh, we actually got a Jeff Winger bobblehead approved to go to Sculpt. We're working on a Senior Chang one. And then uh, going to work on, on down the line. Um, there is community merchandise available now. If you go to NBCStore.com, click on the Show tab, and then scroll down to Community, you'll see uh, notebooks and t-shirts and keychains, all that sort of good stuff. So, uh, Next, we have Hell underscore TCW. Are you planning on having any stores outside of the U.S.? Not right now, but we never say never. So uh, keep on asking, and I'll keep telling my boss that we should be opening up stores overseas. Agent Dung. Can I say that? <laughs> What's it like making merchandise for NBC? It seems like a cool job. Are you hiring? Uh, it is a pretty cool job. Uh, it's it's great making merchandise for NBC. Uh, we get to watch shows ahead of time and read scripts and um, play with silly things like bobbleheads. So it's fantastic. And we're always hiring. Come on down to the store, fill out an application, and uh, we might accept you. We'll have to think long and hard, but. Uh, Val Shopaholic and Rachel846 are both asking when we're going to see white collar and burn notice merchandise. Get questions about this all the time. We're working with Fox to get a merchandise agreement going. So, fingers crossed, sooner rather than later, uh, we will have burn notice and white collar merchandise. Zelly0628, how did you become a buyer? What was your major in college? Um, before I started here, I had about 10 years of retail experience. Uh, I worked in a store, I worked in a warehouse, I worked in a home office. I majored in fashion and retail merchandising, and I got real lucky. And uh, NBC gave me a call, and I moved to New York. Short and sweet. Um, I have no idea how to pronounce this person's name, but she's uh, very vocal on Twitter. Uh, J-E-S-I-D-R-E-S, -E -E one of our favorite Twitter followers. How awesome is your job? Uh, on a scale of, of not so awesome to wicked awesome, it's pretty wicked awesome. Uh, any chance of a Rachel Maddow bobblehead? Uh, very slim chance. Uh, Rachel Maddow wants products that are made in the U.S., and right now there's no bobblehead factories in the U.S. And where are the Maddow mugs? Exclamation points and uh, all caps. Uh, I have no idea what mugs you're talking about. Uh, call underscore online. What is your most popular item? It's the Dwight bobblehead from the office. We got it in about early 2006, and we've sold about 250,000 units so far. Douche Baguette, another one that I'm not quite sure I should be reading. Uh, what merchandise ideas will we never see? Uh, there's lots. We actually have to run some stuff by uh, the show, the producers, the writers, the actors, so there's a lot of concepts that we think are brilliant, but they don't agree with, so you will never see those. Uh, how was kickball yesterday? Uh, my team got our butts kicked, uh, so kickball was absolutely terrible. You might want to ask the other team that. <laughs> I think they had much more fun. Uh, and finally, K-Y-O-O-L, K-U, when creating new merchandise, how do you go about determining what us customers want? What shows, types, designs of items, etc.? Uh, well, we're fans just like you guys are, so uh, what we want, thankfully, you guys want as well. So we determine it based on what shows are really popular, uh, what types of items are already selling in the store, bobbleheads are always popular for us, mugs, t-shirts, so we focus most of our efforts on those. Uh, new shows are also uh, hot topics for us around the office here. Uh, so we also use Twitter, so if you guys have any merchandise requests, send them on through Twitter or Facebook and we'll be sure to get to it. So uh, thank you guys for sending in your questions and keep them coming. We'll be doing this about uh, once a week, once every couple weeks, so thanks.